If you guys need your badges maxed out fast and legit, hit up Star Grinders on Twitter or Instagram and tell them JR sent you. Their links will be in the description down below. This is a Chucky Beat production. 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 What's good YouTube? It's your boy JR and we back with another video. And in this video, I'm about to show y'all boys how to do this sham god. I had a subscriber hit me up and he asked me how to do this move. And you guys already know I'm a deliver. If there's anyone that wants to learn how to do a move, DM me it on Twitter or Instagram. I'll figure it out and I'll make a tutorial on it just to make it easier for you guys. Whenever I learn new moves and stuff like that, it just makes me better at dribbling. And whenever you click on my videos, I'm trying to make you guys better at dribbling as well. You guys already know the vibes, whether it's basic or advanced. I'm gonna bring you guys all the glitchy dribble moves. So yeah, man. Um, make sure y'all drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications, and join the ISO gang. And with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video. So I was in the mod court just messing around with this move just to see what it looks like whenever I add it, incorporate it into my combos. And you can use this Sham God move in your glitchy combos that I've showed you guys throughout my dribble tutorial playlist. Link to that will be in the description down below. Um, this is a good move. Like you can do this little Sham God and you can basic one spin out of it. You can do a behind the back or whatever the case may be. Now one thing about this move is it's extremely easy to get a bump still off of this move. So if you do this move in the park or whatever, you wanna make sure that your defender is not close because if you try to do this into your defender, it'll almost always make you lose the ball. And then two, I'm not sure if you need an 85 ball control for the Sham God or not. You guys can let me know down below. My player has an 85 ball control and I can do it every single time. It might work if you have an 80, 80 ball control, but I'm not exactly sure. So yeah, man, this move is super easy and super simple to do. So as you guys can see by this clip, um, the balls in my right hand you guys want to make sure your player is moving forward You do not want to hold turbo I don't believe that this move will work if you're holding turbo and then as your player is moving forward All you want to do is flick the right stick directly to the right towards like 4 o'clock And then you want to immediately flick the right stick directly up towards 12 o'clock and that will give you this little sham god animation And then if the ball is in your left hand same thing make sure your player is moving forward you don't you do not want to hold turbo while doing this move or i believe it will not work make sure your player is moving forward and then if the ball is in your left hand you want to flick the right stick directly to the left towards like eight o'clock and then immediately flick the right stick up towards 12 o'clock super easy and super simple like i was saying and you saw in the clips at the beginning of the video this move doing the sham god move is just a good way to start off your combos and you can basic one spin into it behind the back or whatever the case may be just be careful if you do this too close to a defender you will lose the ball it's extremely easy to get a bump still off this move so yeah man that's how you guys can do the shaman god super easy super simple let me know if there's any other moves that you'd like for me to show you guys thank y'all boys so much for all support man it really means a lot it's been your boy jr and i'm out peace